Hello student, in this video we are going to see a mesh analysis by using eSpice software. So first we have to draw the circuit diagram. For that we require registers. So type R, place and close this window. So this is the first register, second register, rotate this register by pressing Ctrl R. Third register, fourth one, fifth one, and sixth one register. Now we require DC supply. So we have to select DC from here, VDC. Connect this supply here, rotate it, and connect this supply here, rotate it, and connect the another DC supply at this. Point. Now connect all this component by the wire. Now we require a ground. So click on this and select the ground earth and connect this ground at this point. Now we have to give the value of DC supply and register. So click on this 0 volt and give this 0 volt as a 10 volt. This V2 as a 5 volt. V3 as 20 volt R1 is 1 ohm this R2 is 2 ohms R4 is 5 ohms R3 is 3 ohms R5 is 6 ohms R6 is 4 ohms. Now circuit is completed. So save it by a mesh name. Now simulate this circuit by clicking on this simulation. Now simulation is completed. It is showing here. Simulation complete. Now click on this enable bias current display. So it will give the mesh current in each mesh so click on this so this is the current at each branches of the circuit consider this mesh is I1 this is I2 and this is I3 mesh current in the mesh I1 is 4.273 ampere now current in the mesh 2 is 781.82 milliampere and now what is the current in the mesh 3? It is 5.06 ampere. Thank you.